Yo, can y'all hear me? Yeah, yeah, you're good. Yeah, loud and clear. Guess who the fuck just finished working? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I recently became a single parent from a child that ain't mine. Worst part is I'm not fucking the person because the person happens to be my cousin. And I'm not from Alabama, so I don't touch that shit. Uh, basically, my niece came to live with me in Canada. Uh, she came because they're supposed to, well, my, my family wants her to learn English, French, you know, all these languages. And I said, yeah, that's a smart idea. So in order for her to learn, I've been reading with her, like, you know, the Harry Potter books at night to teach her all these words and stuff. And honestly, Harry Potter is maybe the dumbest fucking kid I've ever in my life read about. <coughs> like, seriously, man. Uh, okay. So this fucking kid lives 10 years of his childhood under a fucking cupboard in the, in the stairs. <laughs> then... <laughs> Discount, discount fucking homeless Santa Claus comes in, takes him to, to an alley, to a, a world of magic. To begin with, the only thing that I'm going to give J.K. Rowling there is that, that that is kind of basically how like child services work in Britain. I'm basically sure that that is true. But my problem with this kid is that, okay, they take him to a school, right? They come to a school and the first five fucking minutes he's inside, this like Gandalf lookalike tells him like, oh, by the way... We have a fucking three-headed, bloody killer dog that kills some sight, and you should never at any fucking point get in front of it. My question would be, this is a school. Why the fuck do they have this shit inside a school? Like, never in my life have school shootings sound more appealing. What would you, what do you believe it's better? <laughs> Die from a bullet in the back or be slowly turned down by a fucking dog? It's the dumbest thing. And then the second thing is they take this child. He's 11. And they tell him, by the way, Magic Hitler wants to kill you for no fucking reason. Only because he fucked up before. And you have no defense against this guy. And then he go, and he never thought about like, well, give me a gun. They go like, no, no, no. We're going to give you a wand that you can, you can use like, you know, killing lightning out of it. You go like, okay, killing lightning. But... I need to learn the fucking words and I need to learn how to fucking move my hand. See, a gun, I don't have to go like, gun no shoot us. I just have to point and shoot. And that's that. End of the fucking problem. Why the hell do I need a wand? Because motherfuckers have survived from lightning. The fucking kid is an example that like, people have survived from lightning. You know what you not survive from? <laughs> a bullet and a fucking knife. How come, how come Voldemort didn't go with, like, it's a baby. I'm just going to stab it to death. Maybe that'll work. <laughs> That's my set, guys, and I'm not supposed to be outside. It's a curfew, by the way.